Welcome. It's a great pleasure and honor to have this opportunity to introduce Giesecke Endevrien's retail CBDC solution to you. As you may know, 50% of GND's revenue is in the banknote business. So CBDC could be seen as a threat to us, but in all our history, we have never seen change as a threat, but always as a chance. And that is what innovation is about. In the next four and a half minutes, I will show you how our GND CBDC solution delivers true benefit to our society in three domains. As a great means of payment that can universally be used, that is truly inclusive, and that can foster innovation and growth. Driven by how a well-designed CBDC can benefit society, we developed GND Filia as our solution. Since day one of our development, we envisioned beyond the existing to enable secure offline payments. However, it is not only capable of a single offline transaction, but secure consecutive offline payments, even without mobile network connection. Obviously, there's a broad consensus that smartphones will continue to dominate mobile payments. GND's range of options in online and offline payment scenarios will dramatically extend accessibility, empowering the unbanked and underprivileged to participate safely and easily in the digital economy, which is not possible today. At its core, GND Filia is a token-based approach with privacy by design and offline functionality as key features. To enable this, we developed the Filia protocol to allow a seamless and highly secure transition of tokens between the online and the offline world. Here, you can see it in use. The Filia ecosystem is utilized by central banks worldwide, trusting GND's unique experience both in public money as well as private payment schemes. One partnership we can publicly discuss is with the Central Bank of Ghana. Currently, only about 84% of Ghanaians have stable access to electricity, while just 53% were connected to the internet. Imagine the impact a digital city will have on their citizens and economy. So, what makes a great means of payment? It must be accessible, even without a bank account, easy to use, low cost, private, and it must have integrity. Our solution consists of three layers. The ultralight payment layer tracks integrity, but not ownership of the monetary tokens circulating in the system. Payment is simply done by transferring such a token from one device to another device, utilizing various communication channels. We can guarantee authenticity of payments without storing personal data nor transaction metadata at that level. Next, we have the data layer that only stores pseudonymous transactions required to assure anti-money laundering and countering the financing of terrorism. On the data layer, it can be defined which data is stored and who can access it according to data contracts. This enables us to truly balance privacy versus transparency in a way that is audible by third parties. Our smart wallet infrastructure, the third layer, provides a powerful rule engine that enables interoperability and innovation, like, for instance, machine-to-machine -machine payments based on smart contracts. The Filia CBDC ecosystem consists of multiple components tailored towards the needs of all stakeholders. Our software development kits enable private sector players to develop programmability use cases, which will certainly enhance competition and drive innovation. It's a pivotal time for the future of money, an opportune moment to create a truly inclusive public digital currency. One that can even solve the simplest of all payment scenarios. Two people in the middle of nowhere without connectivity, but still able to make a payment that is digital, of course.